Right, so we have feeder cable and local distribution. So by moving it from overhead to underground now, we're able to provide more protection to the system by running a backbone, a feeder cable, and taking services off to feed the customers. Since the summer, Fortis BC has been working with the Ministry of Highway and Infrastructure to move electricity assets to make way for the widening of Highway 97. Distribution and transmission lines from Reed's Corner to Highway 33 are currently being moved underground. Underground lines are safer and more reliable than overhead lines. They're less susceptible to motor vehicle accidents, uh, wind-related, storm-related uh, accidents, and it also is uh, uh, last longer and more affordable. The overhead power lines will come down. Um, the general contractor installs the conduit in boxes. We pull the wires in, terminate, install our equipment, energize the new buildings, then we'll take the power down off the poles. The project spans four kilometers and will cost 5.5 million dollars. What's great about this project is because we're working in collaboration with the Ministry of Transportation, it reduces the overall cost. So we end up with a much better, more reliable system, but at less cost to our customers. During this project, Fortis has planned for minimal power disruption to customers. The section of the project from Highway 33 to McCurdy will be done by the end of this year, while the second half of the project will finish in 2017. For Castanet News, I'm Jen Zielinski in Kelowna.